Hello, my friends. Welcome back to Faith Walk 101. We are so glad that you could join us. We've been talking about dressing for success, putting on the whole armor of God. And right now, we still have the hammer of salvation and the sword of the Spirit, which is the Word of God. And we're using the Lord's Prayer as a guide to praying in the Spirit. And when we talk about praying in the Spirit, what we are talking about is praying according to God's will. And to know what God's will is, we have to look into His Word. We have to study His Word. And His Word is the bread. That's what we're going to be eating. And in this verse, Matthew 6 and 11 says, Give us this day our daily bread. And the daily bread is the Word of God. As we eat on that word, uh, the, the Spirit of God is going to speak to our minds and lead us. God knows everything that we're going through. Have you ever noticed that you can pick up the Bible, or you can study something in the Bible, and it will apply to the very things that you are going through that day? It just seems like God already knows, and he puts those scriptures right there. He puts that bread there for you to eat so that when for you to be able to face the day and it is a supernatural thing to happen it's not by accident but when we seek him daily when we eat his bread daily when we sit down and study his word i promise you whatever you study it will have an effect it will apply to something that you're going to deal with that day it's the bread it's the food it's what we're eating and as we pray, we're praying, give us this day our daily bread. We're give, totally dependent on God. We're surrendering to him. We're humbling ourselves. And we're saying, I need him. And I find him in the pages of the word of God. As he speaks through it. It is our bread that we eat. And we should want to. We should desire to. We should uh, feel like we need to because He's saying, give us this day our daily bread. It's our hope to study his word because that's how he's going to speak to us. When we talk about praying in the spirit, what we're talking about is praying according to God's will. And the only way we're going to know that is by studying his word. And so we're asking God to provide what we need to sustain us from day to day. It's a day-to-day -day walk. And as we look into his word, we're asking him to provide the things that we need. When Jesus was tempted uh, by Satan, in Matthew chapter 4 and verse 4, Jesus quotes scripture. Uh, and uh, he's quoting from Deuteronomy uh, 8 verse 3. But we this quote we're finding in Matthew chapter 4 and verse 4. And it says, it is written, man shall not live by bread alone, but by every word. It comes out of the mouth of God. And you know, in the Matthew chapter 6 and verse 33, Jesus says, She keep first the kingdom of God, and all these things will be added to you as well. The kingdom should be our first priority and what we delight in, my friends. Trust Him. Strengthening our minds with the Word of God. Training our minds. We want to be able to pray in the spirit according to god's will continue to join us on faith walk 101 as we talk more about these things thank you my friend